seen over the last week, what is happening in our country and in our state and in our hometown of LA has been absolutely devastating. Um, and I wasn't sure what I could say to you. I wanted to say the right thing and I was really nervous that I, I wouldn't or that it would get picked apart and I realized the only wrong thing to say is to say nothing because George Floyd's life mattered and Breonna Taylor's life mattered and Philando Castile's life mattered and Tamir Rice's life mattered. And so did so many other people whose names we know and whose names we do not know. So the first thing I wanna to say to you is that I'm sorry. I am so sorry that you have to grow up in a world where this is still present. I was 11 or 12 years old when I was just about to start Immaculate Heart Middle School in the fall and um, it was the LA riots, which was also triggered by a senseless act of racism. And I remember the curfew and I remember rushing back home and on that drive home seeing ash fall from the sky and smelling the smoke and seeing the smoke billow out of buildings and seeing people run out of buildings carrying bags and looting and I remember seeing men in the back of a van just holding guns and rifles and I remember pulling up to the house and seeing the tree that had always been there completely charred and those memories don't go away. Now you get to be part of rebuilding. And I know sometimes people say, how many times do we need to rebuild? Well, you know what? We are going to rebuild and rebuild and rebuild until it is rebuilt. Because when the foundation is broken, so are we. You are going to lead with love. You are going to lead with compassion. You are going to use your voice you are going to use your voice in a stronger way than you've ever been able to because most of you are 18 or you're going to turn 18 so you're going to vote. You are going to have empathy for those who don't see the world through the same lens that you do because with as diverse and vibrant and open-minded as I know the teachings at Immaculate Heart are, I know you know that Black Lives Matter. 